Hey everyone, Mr. Johnston here with a quick explanation of how you are going to complete your evidence of learning assignment or the assignment that's taking place of a regular CER assignment for this week. So obviously we have been talking about biomes and your last lesson was doing some research and building out a massive resource of biome information. Today you're going to use that. So for this assignment, you are a travel guide. It is your job to instruct the rest of us on what biome should we visit what can we expect to find there? And why is this a biome we should be visiting? Why is it cool? So there is a lot of information that you need to include in this assignment. Almost all of this information you already collected in the last lesson in that big giant data table. So you are going to go to that giant data table you already created. You are going to pick one of the biomes that's your favorite. This one could be the most interesting, the one that has the most uh, animals that you like, or some other reason. Pick any biome. And then in this section of slides, you are going to include all of this information. And then you're going to build out a slideshow that shows all of us what can we expect to see. You're going to teach us about the biome. And finally, you're going to explain why should we visit this biome. Now, on this slide, you can see the list of things that we're looking for. Obviously, the name, where is it located, the climate and weather, all of this information, most of which you already collected. Some things that you will be adding today, things you did not collect already, is what kind of activity can we do there? Remember, you're a travel guide, so you need to instruct us, people who would vis possibly visit this biome, what activities are there, what can we expect to find, what's going to be fun. Now, because you are trying to sell this biome to us, you're trying to prove to us why we should go, it should be nice to look at. You need to have at least one picture on every single slide so we can see where is it located? What's the weather like? What are the landforms or types of geography we would see there? Are there mountains? Is there water? Is it desert? Is it sandy? You have to explain that on the landform slide. And of course, at the end, we want to know where you got your information. You can't just make it up. We have to get it from credible resources like National Geographic or the handout on your last assignment. Now, all of this information you are going to populate on the slides. You can see there's English and Spanish. You can delete a language you don't want, but we do need to know what is a biome. We need to know the name of the biome you've chosen and where it's located. We need to know the climate and landforms, the plants and animals, the activities we can do, and of course, your sources. You want to copy all of your links here so later when I'm grading this, I can see where did they get their information. Now, when you're finished with this, you should, of course, submit it in Canvas because I cannot see it and I cannot grade it until you turn it in. If you have any questions, you should watch this video again. You should double check your instructions and you do have permission to check with a neighbor. If you've done those three things, you may then raise your hand and I will be happy to check in with you. I'm really excited to see what you come up with and good luck.